We have about 100 people join us for quarterly planning. That's a lot of people. Hey everyone, I'm Becky Judah, Senior Agile Delivery Manager at Clean Choice Energy, and I'm super pumped to share with you how we use Miro for our PI planning meetings. As a renewable energy company, we're always thinking about how to decrease our carbon footprint. Miro was perfect for allowing us to collaborate online, so it's really helped us become greener as a company and also speed up our go-to market and deliver a better customer experience. So what we have here is a template that we use every quarter to stay organized and accountable as we plan for the next six sprints. You'll see here at the top are three sections. The agenda is a high level overview of the workshops as well as the meetings that occur. Then with those meetings in mind, we've found that it's been super helpful to also drop in a calendar. This lays out what to expect. And lastly, in resources are some other tools for an overview of the quarter. So what does success look like for Clean Choice Energy? It starts with our business priorities. In the past, we've had this in a separate sheet and people never knew where it was or how to access it. Embedding that sheet in this board allows it to serve as a centralized location for everything PI planning. These priorities inform the teams about their involvement for the quarter, leading to separate working boards for each team. And it's also an easy way for stakeholders to understand what we're trying to achieve. So let's jump into this example, the web experience team. This grid here is typically filled out by our product owner or team lead to determine the what, and then we turn it over to our engineers to determine the how. And that's where these swim lanes and stickies start to come in. At the top, we have three different labels which indicate whether your team is owning, contributing, or following the specific initiative. So we will use those labels at the beginning of our swim lanes here to help identify our involvement with this project. The other key legend we're gonna go over here is the Fibonacci pointing method. It's been super helpful to color coordinate that way. The engineers are able to think pretty high level. What are the dependencies? What are the complexities? And really start to lay out the solution across the board. We also call out risks with red circles. Typically with this, we will add a comment and say, hey team two, we have a dependency on you for this initiative. Let's make sure we talk about it. You can see here in this template that all the tasks are in sticky notes. But actually when we start filling them in, we will convert them into JIRA tickets like this. Here's an example of what that looks like. And because we have three different teams listed within our board below, we have found that it's important to pull out the larger initiatives from each team and have a dedicated space for them. So what we do is we copy and paste some of the stickies that we see at the boards below and use this cross team tracker as a form of check-in every time we get together. Apart from in-meeting planning, Miro is also a great one-stop shop for visual updates for people who want to know more about a project. Another workshop we do is Future Opportunities, which is also called a pre-mortem workshop. This workshop allows the team to think about the challenges, the successes, or resources they may need. I found with about 100 people, not everyone participates. And if you purposely list out their names here, they will most likely participate. But what that means for me as a facilitator is I have a lot of post-it notes to read through. So one of my favorite features is when I select the sticky note, I use Miro Assist, the AI feature. This helps either cluster by keywords or cluster by sentiment. This helps me so much with saving time and is certainly something I would recommend. For me though, the biggest thing about Miro is the ability to customize it. As a facilitator, I've crafted workshops to unpack difficult conversations or encourage team building activities. Partnering a creative theme with thought-provoking questions in Miro has helped us build high-performing teams. So that's what I have for you today. If you like our template, you can download it for free in Miroverse. And if you have any questions, feel free to tag me in the community forum. Thanks so much, everyone. Take care.